Nope. See ya. This is Fred's first marshmallow. Fuck me up, bro. <laughs> Will I cry? Will I leave behind? Broken and crumbled signs Hiding all my roads to you Good morning guys, woke up in my tent looking like uh... So that intro was a video of Fred last night eating his first s'more. Like one month ago, I was also giving someone their first pancake. What's up with people? No s'mores, no pancakes? So right now we're sitting over top of San Jacinto out there. And this is about 800 feet. We can go for a quick flight. One of my buddies let me borrow a Hero 5, so we're gonna try that out. Stoked. Hey buddy, how's your balloon jump? Yeah. so sick. Playing like it's felt like, you know like the first time you jump out of a plane, you're like, I don't think I should jump out of this plane. That's like how I felt about the world. Like, I don't think I should jump out of this. Like, I just like fell backwards and just like the balloon. Looking at Dave's video right now of his balloon jump this morning and uh, sorry for the news Dave, but um, you shut off your camera right before you're supposed to jump. There's no way. Thought, what? That doesn't make any sense. Like, I didn't turn it off. Wait, that's so weird. Dude, oh, sucker. <laughs> <laughs> I can't deny I believed it. <laughs> Dude, everything's funnier when you say it with your French accent, by the way. It's made for movie. Jesus. Okay, so I was talking with Dave a little bit earlier, and I was telling him, man, I do all these different sports, and I just feel like I suck at all of them. And that's because obviously I'm spending all my time doing all these different sports instead of concentrating just on one. If I mean, if I compare myself to other people in the... We'll take a look. So, what people normally do is, you check out the graph right here, we have their abilities. So you have, so you people, have people here, here people, people here, here, people, people here, 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 here. And so what happens is based on your position inside, inside of, of this, this like ball of abilities, abilities, you judge how good you are. So maybe if you're right here, here for, for example, example, you go, you go Oh yeah, like I'm pretty good. Maybe, Maybe you're here, here and you're, and you're like, like, oh, I'm, I'm so good at this sport. But what about when we take into account, account human capabilities? There's all this empty space, space up, up here. here. We're, we're not, not anywhere, anywhere near, near it because we're so busy focusing all of our time on all these different little things. Imagine if we took all that time and we focused it on the one thing. We could, we could take, take our, our levels, levels up, up into, into this, this blank, blank spot, spot of human, human capabilities. capabilities. And so it's super cool that in like two weeks from now, I'm going to be skydiving every day for two months and concentrating on that and getting my tandem rating. But what does that mean? That means for two months, I also won't be speed flying. I'll be near Chicago. I won't be rock climbing outside as much. I'll be very concentrated and getting good at one thing but it's kind of 
sad in a way. I have to leave behind other things. It's only gonna be temporary though, after I get my coach rating and my tandem rating so I can jump out of planes with people. I would like to go to a spot to work doing tandems where it is close to somewhere where I can fly all the time. Like out of a plane and also down a mountain. And if I fight, will I better sometimes I just feel like such a dirt ball out here we're in like this dusty like the dust covers everything and then I'm unshaven I feel homeless so you're never homeless if home is where the heart is wing is that this is the Mirage RS Pro comp something like that terrifyingly small barely makes it to the landing area if you dump the trims off of launch and it's okay if I fly that it's great if you fly that yeah Right there. Cool, man. Yeah. Thanks. A little bit windy, but I think this wind will be really good because of the small canopy that's in there. Help us get right off the ground real nice and quick. This thing is so small. I don't think anyone should be flying this. <laughs> Lay down here. <laughs> Lay down and have it be like the same length as my body. All right, brother. Have fun. And then as soon as you dump the trim, the trim are on the rear lines of the wing and they change the angle of attack so you're going faster and down further. And you open those up for landing so you don't stall your wing. And as soon as I open those up, you're gonna feel how quickly, without even turning, because when I start to actually turn on this wing, you can really feel the weight shift by just moving my leg like that much, really feel it. And then on landing, the ground is coming very fast, but you know you have to wait until that last second with speed wings to kind of flare out. And so it all worked out. Sick wing. Brad, you got my camera in your pocket, man. You can't be doing crazy maneuvers like that. Because I love it, you know? <laughs> And then when you're coming in for landing, on your first flight on it, you really feel like, like olden day wars. Like, don't shoot until you see the whites of their eyes. Which means, don't flare until that perfect moment because you're coming at the ground like... And the ground's right here, and if you flare early, it's gonna be no bueno. Thanks for letting me buy your ring, man. Oh, hell yeah, dude. My pleasure. Um, my Thanks for filming. With, uh, okay. Is with um, any of the videos.
What happened? Where's the where's the where's the drone? It's at the 800. Oh, you just you landed it? I did not. It's just sitting there floating. Going to do like one last flight right now. Carl has the Mavic Pro by DJI, the drone, and he's going to try to like fly it up there and film it. And I'm pretty stoked about that. Nope. See ya. Watching you on the like the little camera thing, we didn't think you were gonna get off. <laughs> yeah, when you told me you're like Adam, I'd wait for the air to clear. I was like, no, this air is like perfect right now. Thanks, dude, so much. Oh, dude, I know you're concentrated. Sucks. Thanks for the footage. We'll look at that. Where'd it go? No, the drone footage. This stuff was like literally amazing. It was the first time I'd ever had like nice barrel rolls, like recorded with a drone. I accidentally deleted it. I want to figure out something soon to take care of that problem so like I can get more drone footage more often. We'll figure that out soon. Carla, you'd say this is the best place in San Jacinto? I, in my opinion. There's kind of limited fine dining options around here. So I was imagining like one big roll. Really? I didn't realize it was like. Cut up? Yeah, yeah. Thanks. Yeah, that looks so good. Thank you.